As the world commemorates International Day of the Girl Child, Nigerians and Hope Builder Foundations have joined their counterparts across the globe to celebrate the impact of the girl child in the society. As tools for national development, they say the challenges facing the girl child, especially in our environment, are discrimination in access to education and domestic violence, which according to them affects psychologically and mentally. Plus TV News correspondent Habila Darafai's report has presented from our studios. Every 11th October is a day set aside to celebrate the International Day of the Girl Child. The theme for this year is Our Time Is Now, Our Right, Our Future. It focuses on the need to address the challenges girls face and also to promote girls' empowerment for the fulfillment of the God-given potentials in the society. Speaking at the Our Lady Queen of Fatima School in Sabo, Kaduna State, the Executive Director of Hope Builders, Dr. Matthias Yashim, states that the aim is to eliminate gender-based challenges that girls face around the world, including domestic violence, poor learning opportunities, and gender discrimination that makes them not to have a voice in the society. He added that the girl child has the potential to change the world as the empowered girls of today is tomorrow's worker, mother, entrepreneur, mentor, household head, and political leader. It shows that young girls are struggling with, women generally are struggling with that, and uh, nobody seems to be paying attention to that. Uh, so many of them also, it is just within themselves that the confidence to really face the world is lacking in them. Oftentimes when you hear there is marginalization, there is stigmatization, there is all this and that and that, yes, those things are there, but the key is that the girls don't have the courage and the confidence to pursue their dreams. And if you have a purpose, you need to have ambition. The school principal, Reverend Sister Regina McCutry, on our part, said that the girl child is the most precious social asset in any society and nation. She stressed that training a girl child is to train a nation and building of the society and the world. So if concentration will be paid to their education, whether they have it in villages, in town, or anywhere they can meet the girls here because there are many who would have loved to have the opportunity but are handicapped. Some of the girls express their delight. To them, being a girl is not a weakness but a strength. They however lament the high rate of occurs and call on the government to provide an enabling environment for the girl child education to thrive in the society. The boys are being more preferred than the girl child because being a girl is a privilege that many people don't understand. I dream of being a better girl child. I pray that all the girl childs will be able to go to school to become what they want to be. I feel blessed to be opportune to be in a school. I feel very sad for the girl children who are placed on the streets those ones who don't have the opportunity to get education. Other highlights of the event are the distribution of sanitary pads to adolescent girls and the presentation of awards to some of the students and also to teachers who have impacted positively on the life of the girl child, among others. The 2022 International Day of the Girl Child is the 10th anniversary of the United Nations Special Observance to celebrate their impact and contribution in society and in nation building. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.